Right here is my makeup room. So if we open the door, I have that light on, so it's going to be the lighting's going to be off, but it's not quite bright enough without it. So this is kind of just like a quick little overview of the room. It's not quite finished, but I figured I will just um, do a video uh, of kind of my setup over here because I think I got that pretty well organized. So. Um, the chair obviously does not match the theme of the room. Uh, I think I'm going to sell this and I want to get a different one that kind of is a little bit more of the animal print theme. So I guess I'll start over here. So I got this trunk. Uh, Benji got it for me for Christmas from TJ Maxx. And it's just a really nice leather trunk. Um, there's just all kinds of stuff. If you open this bottom one, this is all sample size products. So I kind of organized it the best I could. Um, like I have like cleansers, mo face moisturizers, hair stuff, lotions. Um, these little plastic uh, bags are great for anything with liquids so that if they break or spill it doesn't ruin your bag. So this is just all my small travel and sample size stuff. And then if we open this one, this one has, I'm going to be doing a video um, with these bags and show you what I'm packing for Hawaii. So those are in there. And then these are just a bunch of sunglasses. I have a lot of them. And some jewelry cleaner right there in the back. So I just have a ton of sunglasses. So they're kind of all just in there because I don't have really any place to put them. Then this drawer. This is all my empty palettes, so I converted everything to Z palettes. If you want a video, let me know and I will show you my Z palettes. But anyways, these are all the old ones I had from Star Makeup Haven, I think is what it's called, or Star Makeup Heaven is where I got all these palettes. Um, I depotted all of my Tarte blush, uh, blushes, but I keep these so that if I'm traveling, since the Z palettes are kind of heavy, if I just want to take one or two, I can just pop them back in here. Um, here is a bag. I just have some stuff in there that I give to my mom, um, like makeup and stuff I don't use. And then this is the big Mally uh, primer. Um, and my Back to Mac stuff is in a bag right there. And then this one has um, a bunch of lashes just in this little container I got from the dollar section of Target. Um, my spare beauty blenders, some extra eyelash curlers, some blotting sheets. This was from Urban Decay. It's their glitter stuff. Some more eyelash curlers. These are all my backup or extra products. So I have an extra Mary Luminizer, um, Bahama Mama. I picked up a bunch of these. So I have, I gave one away. So I have one left of a backup of the Vanity Palette. And then these are extra um, Whisper of Guilt and Superb from the Extra Dimension. These are all mascaras that I haven't opened, some eyeliners, EOS lip balm. So that's just kind of extra stuff there. And then this is kind of what I have sitting on top of that. I changed it a little bit. In my other videos, you'll have noticed that I had my perfume there and I moved my perfume and I like this a lot better because I think that's really cute to look at as the background of my, um, of my videos. And this is the painting that you kind of see the bottom part of. Um, it's really cool. It has like a map or a world around it and then like a city scene of Paris. So I just really love that. I know it doesn't really go with the jungle theme. I'm kind of, I don't know really what the theme of this room is, but that's okay. So here we got this at TJ Maxx. It's just a big thing, <laughs> like dried flowers or leaves or something. And then I have this little setup here. So I got this from Benji for Christmas. It's just a big K for Cassie. And then I have, these are um, Moji Cubes. Um, I'll go through those in a second. So over here, I just have my Scandinavia setting spray, some Sony Kashuk brush cleaner, eye makeup remover, Fix Plus, my one YSL lip gloss, or lipstick that I love, and a little Kabuki brush. I got this at TJ Maxx as well, just in the office supplies. So I have my shorter little palettes here. These are the Shady Lady palettes, the Meat Matte palette, this is Urban Decay palette, these are my Project Tin Pan um, eyeshadows I need to use up in a Z palette, this is kind of like a smoky eye palette I put together, I have both naked palettes, my Nude Tube palette, all my Sleek palettes, these are all my MAC palettes, um, and I have them organized, these are the purple and pinks, these are the neutrals, those are the like coppers and blues and greens. And then this is my Makeup Geek eyeshadows. 
Then I have my Urban Decay Book of Shadows, my little Too Faced palettes, and then in the drawers. So the first one is all my eyeliners. So I did have it organized. These were all black and then these were all colored, but for the most part they're still kind of that way. The next drawer down is some gel liners. This is an amazing Sony Kashuk eyeshadow or eyeliner palette with they're kind of shadows. Just some random products, some more gel eyeliner, some scissors for your brows, um, my Benefit Brow Kit, um, Anastasia Brow Kit, some more brow products, some small travel size mascaras, more mascaras, clear brow gel, mascaras, These and then these are all face powders. Um, this one, this one, and that one are all too light, so that's why they're in here, because I um, they're too light for me. Over on this side, I have all my MAC lipsticks, MAC lip glosses, some more MAC lipsticks, and drugstore lip gliss, lipsticks that I couldn't fit up in here, um, lip glosses, and more lip glosses. Okay, so that's kind of that area. Then if we move over here, this I just got at Target. It's a little cup. It's a mug. These are just kind of like my everyday brushes that I use all the time. Um, I just kind of keep them in there because they're easy and I can remember to clean them. And then this is the book I got from Felicia, Love Fashion 5. I have that right here because it's a fun book to flip through. And then I have um, my blush palettes right there. This was also from Target, or no, TJ Maxx. Um, this is my MAC blush palette. I have some more MAC uh, blushes I got to stick in there. And then there's my Tarte blush palette. And these are a bit heavy, so they're kind of too heavy to travel with. Um, this I got from TJ Maxx, just a little spinny office supply. This is all of my kind of pinky lip liners. These are more of my nude lip liners or whatever didn't fit in here. These are my Urban Decay um, shadow sticks. And then these are my NYX Jumbo pencils. So they're all kind of in there. And I have some random ones, a Mally and a Tarte one in there too. So I just keep those all here. And then these are just tall canisters. I think I got them at Michael's. So I have one for my um, Q-tips. And then I have another one over here for my cotton pads. Here's just a little mirror here. I have a TV right above it. And then this is from Pampered Chef. This just has kind of some other face brushes and eye brushes. And I kind of have them sectioned. Like these are buffing brushes. This is blush, contour, highlight, and then just a bunch of random eye brushes. And then over here is where I have all my perfumes. I got this at Target, it's just like a serving tray. And then I got um, these little things here. They're for like pencils and stuff, and I just turn them sideways. And then like if you can see in there, they have little shelves. But of course, the only ones that I can get them to fit in are the big shelf here. So um, then it's kind of, you know, I like the way that it looks where it's kind of tiered rather than all sitting together. And then this little box is actually from Africa. And um, it has just all my sample size in there. So I just kind of have that over there. And then um, I guess I'll do these drawers right here. So this desk I got at Office Max if anyone cares. So when you open this, I have all of my drugstore lipsticks that I can fit in here. Two are missing because I have them. Um, you'll see where they're at in a second. All my Revlon lip butters, some more drugstore lip glosses or lipsticks. Um, this is all just kind of random lip products, like the jelly tube type things. All of my Tarte um, lip surgeons, which I really need to start using. Um, any kind of tubed type of lip glosses in here. Um, I don't really have a home for this because it's so big, so it's in there for now. And then I need to do a video and review on this, so it's kind of just sitting in there for the time being. And then back here I just have um, a notepad, uh, two of these little antibacterial soaps. I have two MAC, one's a lip conditioner and one's like a lip, whatever they're called, tender tone, uh, some more chapstick, and then these are my lip scrubs, so that's what's in that one. Oh, um, these were on, from Amazon, they're just lipstick holders, I got this at um, Target for like a dollar, and I got this from Target for like a couple bucks, so we don't have like Hobby Lobby or Container Store or anything cool like that here, so. Um, this is both from Target 2. They're like a dollar. So this side I have loose MAC eyeshadows that I need to depot. 
Here's a bunch of little MAC palettes. These were, I got these at a CCO there from a Christmas collection. Um, what is this? The Reelers and Rockers eyeshadow. The Six Beauties Play It Cool or something like that. These are um, Call Me Bubbles. Um, this one is Color 3. This one is Shop and Drop. And then this one is the Color Added. So, if you ever want to see any other tutorials with those, let me know. Um, then this is a really old um, Hello Kitty one. I don't think I can open it with one hand. No, it won't happen. Oh, let's see. Yeah, so old Hello Kitty one. I tried to depot them and it just didn't work. So, um, and then on this side I have all of my Wet n Wild palettes, um, and then just a bunch of random loose eyeshadows. So those are kind of my random palettes, and I don't think I have anything there in that. And this one's kind of my junk drawer. I have um, a brush holder thing here, some brush, a brush belt, some cosmetic bags. Eye makeup remover. Um, this should be in the travel area, but that's okay. Um, some scissors, tape, um, some lotion, a calendar that I think is actually outdated, and some cell phone holders. So that's kind of my junk drawer. So, and then there's a bag. I have a dress I need to return to Target. I have a power cord with a cell phone charger, my camera charger, trash can. That bin over there is my products I've used up, so I can do a video. And then this is stuff I need to um, do a video on as well. So I kind of just sit here, and um, then I have this little mirror here for myself. This is from Target. It's meant to hold a candle in it like that, but it actually works perfectly to prop my camera up on, so that's what I do with that. Then there's this section here, which is for a keyboard. And in a video, I mentioned I'm going to be doing the um, makeup basket idea, but I'm probably going to do it at the end of the week to show what I used. So um, this is from a gift set for perfume. These little trays I got at Target. So like this side, I have all of my face products. Um, and here I have my, well, this is like, yeah, my face. This is all my cheek products for the week and lip products and then this is all my eye products for the week so that's kind of what's in there I won't go through it because I'm gonna have a video of what's in there and it's gonna change every week so then I also have this area here so you open that up and let me get down here so I can actually show you the lighting's probably not gonna be so great so this is a tart um, little gift or palette box thing um, that I got. So that's in here. I never really use it. I have some makeup wipes. These are Moji containers or Muji. They have kind of all my high-end blush and my Sonia Kashuk blushes. These are all powder products. So I have Hot Mama, Frat Boy, a Clinique, a NARS, two Benefits, actually three Benefits. Then this one is MAC that I need to depot. And then these, Benji got these for me. I don't know where he got them. Um, but they're just like cardboard, but they're really nice and they're really deep. So the first one is all of my face products. So this is like my strobe lotion, all my primers, sunscreen, illuminators. Um, that's all in here. And then the second drawer down, this is all of my face, more face stuff. So this is all my foundations, tinted moisturizers, and concealers. And it goes back pretty far, so that's what's in there this is all of my cream blushes so um, and then drugstore powder blushes in the back so there's just tons of NYX and um, Revlon um, what else Sony Kashuk ones are amazing um, all my bouncy blushes and then some elf and some physicians formula in the back and some wet wild I'll be able to use them more now that I'm doing the makeup basket idea. Um, this is all my bronzers and highlighters. So I have my Bahama Mama, Sleek, Revlon, Hoola, Too Faced, NYX, MAC. There's some MAC powders in the back. These are all like high cream highlighters. Um, this is an eyeshadow, but I use it as a highlighter. My Luminizer, Too Faced, MAC, Extra Dimensions. That's all in there. This one is all my eye primers, so I have lots of little sample ones. 
have these gel eyeliners, but um, I use them as bases. Um, little mini Urban Decay, my um, Maybelline eye tattoos, my paint pots, it's all in there. And then the bottom one is just kind of random. Some oil blotting sheets, some extra hand lotion, some baby lips, some lotion, chapsticks, that's kind of what's down here, I guess. So um, that's kind of what I have stored in there. So I will, there's my phone, my coffee. So again, that's kind of my setup. And then my chair goes right in there. And then I got this trunk from, um, they had this big like craft show and I got this trunk for like 50 bucks or 100 bucks. Um, that is a new bag I just got. If you want to see a review on it and see how I pack it to travel, let me know. That little elephant I got, um, my dad got me from, uh, Africa. I have the screen. That was meant to go behind me, but I can't really get it to work. Just a couch. There's my rug. I don't really like this rug. Um, and back there is my printer for my other work that I do. <laughs> and then, um, this is the lighting that I use. They're just these studio lights. I got them from Amazon. They work really good. And then minus the mess that's in here, because this is like Benji's changing room for all of his work stuff. But this is where I store all my nail polish. Let me turn the light over here. So I got these from Amazon, and I just have them in order kind of by color. So I have like all of my gray tones up there. Then I have kind of my metallic-y rose gold and neutrals. Then all of my blues and mints. Uh, my yellows, my reds, all my purples, pinks, um, orangey coral colors, glitter polishes, top coats and base coats. Um, this little guy's from Target and just has all my nail files, just random nail stuff. My nail polish remover, I love the ones with the little sponge. You can see I like test colors and combinations all the time. Um, and that's kind of where my nail polish is. And then down here is like, we have board games and then that's kind of just more makeup stuff. These are more brushes that I don't use as often um, and I just didn't need all of them out there. So we'll switch up my brushes sometimes too. So anyways, let me go back over here. So that is my makeup storage filming area for all of you guys to see. I've had a ton of requests to do an updated one. So that's kind of um, where I film. And then this is kind of my view. This is our front yard. We have a little um, creek, like a little creek bed thing there that was here and Benji filled it with black rocks. Um, and that's kind of our front yard. I think there's a, they're fixing a sprinkler. But yep, that's kind of my view of what I see when I look out my window and film. It's a pretty view. So I hope you guys enjoyed and um, that you weren't disappointed by my makeup storage. Um, if there's anything else you want to see, uh, any videos on, let me know. Hope you're having a good day. Thanks, guys.